Basic Math Number 4 Understanding U.S. Money United States money is issued under the authority of the Federal Reserve System. The bills remain in circulation for four and a half to fifteen years depending on the denomination and then they're destroyed and replaced with new bills. Let's look at the coins. This is a penny and it is equal to one cent. It is 0 0.01 of a dollar, one one hundredth, and it has a picture of Abraham Lincoln on it. This is a nickel right here. It is five cents, equal to 0 0.05 or five one hundredths of a dollar, and has a picture of Thomas Jefferson on it. This is a dime, ten cents, equal to 0 0.10 or ten one-hundredths of a dollar and has a picture of Franklin D. Roosevelt on it. This is a quarter equal to 25 cents, 0.25 or 25 one-hundredths, one-fourth of a dollar and has a picture of George Washington on it. The half dollar is 50 cents. It is 50 cents of a dollar, half of a dollar and has John F. Kennedy on the front of it. Now let's see the paper money. This is the front and this is the back. Now as you can see, I'm using play money so the real money doesn't have the Asian print with pretend play money written on it. Other than that, it pretty much looks like this. This is a dollar, one dollar. It's got ones in the corners and says one dollar down here. They have a number on them to identify them. And it's got a picture of George Washington on the front and a pyramid with an eye and an eagle on the back. This is a $5 bill. It's got Abraham Lincoln on the front and the Lincoln Memorial on the back, which is located in Washington, D.C. This is a $10 bill. It's got Alexander Hamilton on the front and a picture of the U.S. Treasury in Washington, D.C. on the back. This is a $20 bill. It's got Andrew Jackson on the front and a picture of the White House in Washington, D.C. on the back. This is a $50 bill. On the front is a picture of Ulysses Grant and on the back is a picture of the U.S. Capitol in Washington, D.C. Then we've got the $100 bill, and the reason I put a green star here is because the $100 bill has Benjamin Franklin on it and a picture of Independence Hall in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania on the back. All of the bills have pictures of presidents and buildings located in Washington, D.C., except this bill has an inventor on it and a building in Pennsylvania. You can read more about money on the internet, but this is a basic understanding of U.S. money and its value.